Hello everyone, I hope you guys are having a wonderful day. I am Arif, your Cloud Learning Journey Partner. In today's video, I'm going to talk about AWS Solutions Architect Certification. How can we prepare ourselves for the certification? Well, uh, for me, it took almost one month to do the whole preparation. Before that one month, I never heard of AWS. So if you can follow my footsteps, I can guarantee that you guys can also do it. So without further delay, let's get started. My first suggestion is to actually visit this um, website. Here you can see a detailed overview of AWS Solutions Architect Associate Certification. Here you can see the level which is uh, associate. Length is 130 minutes, almost two hours. Cost is 150 USD. Uh, exam format is uh, multiple choice most of the time and uh, we'll get almost 65 questions to answer. We can take this exam online or we can go to a test center and uh, sit for the exam. Uh, my suggestion to you is that please go through each and every line. Here you'll get a better visibility of what this exam is all about and how you'll be tested. So this is very critical to actually know each and every component about this certification. Uh, here we will also get some exam free materials. Um, uh, the main thing that I always suggest to actually please go through this white paper named as AWS Well Architect Framework. As the certification is focusing more about uh, cloud solutions architect, so that reason AWS Well Architect Framework you must have to know. You must have to know each and every concept related to it. Whenever I prepare for any certification, I always prefer to actually go for multiple sources of uh, course material. The benefit is that if one course material is uh, uh, missing something, then it can be covered from other course materials. So uh, I would also say the same. Uh, uh, but primarily, the primary uh, course material that I would suggest is this book. This is an official book for associate certification. and. Uh, at the very first what I did, I went through each and every single line of this book. I highlighted the complex concept that I was struggling to understand to actually uh, review it later. So how I finished the book, first I went through real quick by highlighting and second time I just read the highlighted portion which was uh, complex from my point of view which helped me actually to clear all the concepts that are present in this book. The second source that I am suggesting is this specific video titled as AWS Certified Solutions Architect Associate. So this is a 10 and a half hours long video tutorial and trust me this is a good one. I have uh, gone through it and this is amazing. Here all the core comms concepts related to AWS services will be cleared after watching this video. And huge shout out to Free Code Camp because they did an amazing job to actually create this video. My next suggestion is to actually go through it Amazon Web Service official YouTube channel. So here, uh, why we're looking into this channel? Because uh, I want you guys to actually understand AWS very clearly. Uh, whenever we go for any certification, our end goal should to be to understand the technology, to use the technology. Certification is a proof that I know that, we know that, but if we have the real experience, if we can use those services properly for an instance for AWS after having this AWS Solution Architect as a certification we should be able to um, configure AWS environment we should be able to uh, deploy a web application in AWS so that should be our end goal and this channel is very useful to gain that sort of insight so here you will see thousands of videos so you should be passionate about this certification or any sort of certification whenever you are going through any uh, certification process just be passionate about it try to learn more and more and try to gain knowledge because um, after what's the point of getting certification because you want to get a good job really to this field right and once you get the job then you have to do this all of this work if you are passionate about it and if you learn about it eventually you will get better at your job and you will enjoy the whole journey so please go through this channel and try to learn more and more concepts and here you can see some uh, videos where uh, different companies are uh, showing their architectural diagram 
which is a very good resource here they are saying what best practices they are using how aws is helping them to scale up how aws is helping them to remediate the security issues so it is definitely very important for you guys to actually know all of this concept and uh, the only way you can learn this concept to spend some time to watch all of these videos one by one aws solutions architecture society is more of a hands-on certification because uh, i still remember when i was uh, sitting for the exam all the questions were related to a practical hands-on experience so they describe a scenario and uh, they give us options like how can we solve or sort out this problem so you have to uh, think about it you have to draw the diagram in your brain and uh, you have to answer according to it so how can we be so good that we can just uh, imagine the whole scenario so the only way to get that sort of uh, expertise is that to go through the aws uh, web console so this is the page here you need to sign up so you need to create your own AWS account uh, and the good part is this is uh, uh, free of cost. So AWS has a free tier. So let me uh, describe what is free tier. So for major AWS services like EC2, RDS, they provide us some sort of uh, free resources. So we can use 720 hours of free AWS EC2 instances. So in this way, we can uh, learn and we can implement uh, without any cost. So uh, I highly recommend, please uh, sign up for this AWS uh, console and try to, so when, whatever concept you learn, try to implement it, try to configure it using this AWS console. And if you face any issues um, or if you want to troubleshoot any issues, uh, you can just do it from the console. And uh, if you need any help, then I'm always here. So just send me a message in the comment section. I will definitely help you and answer and solve the problem that we were facing. Congratulations for reaching this far of this video. So now I'm gonna help you to list down some very important AWS services that we must have to know very clearly for this certification. Um, we must need to know EC2, we must need to know RDS, S3, IAM, Route 33. So in this video's description section, I'm gonna list down 10 AWS services. So if you know these 10 AWS services, the chances of passing the certification is 80 to 90 percent. But you must have to know ins and out of the services. So please look into the description section of this video. Now let's talk about some preparation tips. The first tip from mind is to being persistent. Uh, suppose one day you feel really motivated, you studied five hours. That is impressive. But the next day you feel really exhausted and you uh, don't study any single minute so this is not a good thing remember certification is more like a marathon it's not a sprint so you have to be consistent so even if you study for half an hour or one hour per day that is good as long as you are keep going because uh, if you lose the focus then you won't uh, get certified because it's the small steps that will add up and help you to get certified the second step is that uh, you must need to create one notebook. In the notebook, you're gonna have to write down all the key important topics that you feel like, yes, it's very important to remember. So what uh, will happen that at the very last moment when you are almost ready for certification or before a week, you can just go through those uh, key points which will help you really being confident in the exam hall you will go there with confidence because you know that you have done your studies and you are fully prepared for the certification thank you so much guys for watching my videos i really do appreciate it i know the most important thing in the world is time and you guys are spending time to watch my videos and that's why i try my best to provide some value in exchange of time and uh, that's my uh, goal i really want you guys to be successful i want you guys to be a very good uh, it professionals and uh, i want to grow a community where we will help each other to be a better version of ourselves if you have any questions related to this certification please feel free to send me a message under this comment section i am guaranteeing that i will re reply you back uh, please like and subscribe to my channel to uh, see my future videos related to it technologies um, that's all for today and goodbye for now